Yo, what it is, what's poppin' gang, man? What it is, what it do, man? It's your boy, Kuiz, man, a.k.a. Kuiz is so motherfucking dope, you heard me, man? Pressure busting all your little bitches pipe. You heard me, man? Yeah. What it is, what it do, man? What's poppin', gang? Hope all of y'all there, man, having a dope-ass day, man, because lucky boy, I just having the dopest, you heard me? Bro, I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I just got back in yesterday. Uh, if you guys haven't already seen the vlog, man, you guys check it out, man. Um, I did throw it out on the last video, but um, I just got back in, man. I had a, received a message while I was in while I was in Louisiana, man, the other day. Uh, let me know that I had a package that came in. I really thought it was for something else, um, dealing with the wedding, but it wasn't. But came home, man, and I got a huge, huge, huge surprise, man. Capital Hemp, man, came back with two more, two more exotic strains, bro. As you guys seen from the last video, I did smoke all of the cereal milk, man, from Capital Hemp, bro, and I did smoke majority of the, um, what was the other one called? Yeah, I ended up smoking all of this, as you guys seen from the last video, man, I just ended up smoking all of the cereal milk, and I smoked damn near majority of all of the seven grammeters HH8 Frost LG, man. As you guys can see, man, I only have a nug left. I'm gonna show you guys. Literally a nug left, man, that's all been busting it up bro capital hip i told you guys man they have some awesome products man awesome products bro but if you guys looking for some good strong bud and good hemp man as far as not over the top high but still gonna get you right there that you you know exactly where you like to be and still be able to manage and do things capital hemp dog and i'm a, I'm a person you can get it from a person like me as i like smoking a lot and i'm i like pretty much strains where I can benefit off of them as far as like the effects, like um, pain, muscle uh, spasms, uh, headaches. You know, I like a lot of like mind and body, you know, strains. You know, sometimes I do, I do enjoy hybrids where, you know, I like to get a little, you know, a little uppity, but sometimes I do like to stay calm and relax, you know what I'm saying? And just, just chill. But this Frosty OG, man, it stands up, man. Also, what I'll be doing is sometimes I may put a little bit of bud inside with my regular bud and mix it in together, man. It doesn't do anything different. All it does is give you a little extra buzz of a high. Um, I did notice with the new strains that I'm about to show you guys, I put it in with my other weed, man. It tastes, nothing tastes off. It's perfect. It tastes amazing. I see why they have to go ahead and vacuum seal it, man. Um, it's so gassy of a 3.5 of some THCA purple gorilla man Don't you guys see that man now thing is I've smoked out of both of these already as you guys see it kind of been tampered with already I'm going to show you guys exactly what it look like take it out yeah um like I said I did smoke out of both of them so I'm able to tell you guys actually you know the effects of everything like this one here is my favorite purple gorilla man look at this man you guys can't see it like talking about look at that man beautiful purple man the nugs man like to be honest with you this is what you i'm, I'm, I'm gonna be honest with y'all this is basically what like you would say you would get from your plug you know what I'm saying? You, you know, you ride around, you you know, you, you neighborhood plug. That's what you would normally find, man. This is what you, what you consider some gas. This is testing that 10% THC, man. Oh my God, bro. Like the bud is just ridiculous, man. This purple gorilla, man, is just ridiculous. I've been smoking this one like, like no other, bro, for a 3.5, man. Look at that, man. Beautiful nugs, man. I had some bigger ones than that, bro. The bigger ones in there they had a, it's pretty like how would i call it has some light purple hues in there man light purple um light green got a lot of frosty frosting is going on here um beautiful orange hairs you break it up hand is all full of it man it's like kind of sticky a little bit man beautiful bro beautiful bro cured correctly cured you know to perfection man um, what I will be doing in this video, man, I will be rolling up a J, man. I will be smoking the Blazy Susans, man. Did you guys see that, man? Yeah, six cones. 
um, slow burning, ultra thin, vegan, GMO free, purple cones. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm gonna bust them up, man. Just a nice little quick J with you guys, bro. Smoke a little something, something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably gonna move everything outside and smoke one outside, bro. But the other strain I have is a 3.5 of some THC Afghan Kush. Now this one here, this one packs a punch. You guys gonna see the difference and you gonna see the reason on why, man. I smoked this one too, bro. Ridiculous, you guys. Look at this, man. This is ridiculous, man. I wish you guys could like pretty much better see that, man. Purpley, man, beautiful. And this is a fat nug again, man. My, I have a big hand, you guys. But, shit. I'm almost the same size of my thumb. Oh, man. This one right here, bro. It smells like grapey-ish. Skunky-ish. Very, like, sweet. Very, very sweet orange hairs on there purpley man it's just, this is like grown so beautifully and so like well put together man bro them they're both um they're considered to be like hybrids but i do consider them like uh pretty much like some indicas i do consider the purple gorilla pretty much more of your um you will still get you still be down off of it like like the, the after effects is like where it, it settles you down but the beginning effects it keep it give you the red eye make you feel relaxed make you feel focused make you laugh a lot it does make you laugh a lot both strains make you laugh a lot i feel like the afghan kush is more on like more on like the downer side like if you're trying to like get some rest if you're trying to like just relax after a long day the afghan kush is the one to actually like go with um Pretty much if you're trying to just like you want to get settled in you want to be relaxed but you don't want to get like you don't want to just jump straight to sleep you want to just you know watch some tv you know um and just maybe like ooze off into sleep and you know watch you a, watch you a couple tv shows and a couple you know whatever you want to do man i would say the purple gorilla man very good man the thca man as you guys notice man thca is a little bit stronger man um to be honest with you, I, I prefer THCA over the Delta 8. Um, over pretty much a lot of Delta 8, but pretty much I don't really care for Delta 8 like talking about because I'm starting to fall out of love with, with Delta 8 because of all the, like, I feel like it's been, it's been, I feel like they're putting too many things on the bud. I don't like some of the chemicals that be on it. Not with Capital Hip, I haven't had that experience with them. But some other companies that I've, you know, tried out before. Not all of them, not. I'm not going to say all of them. There are some good Delta 8 out there. Don't let me tell you guys that all oh, Delta 8 is bad because it's not. They have some great Delta 8 out there, man. Some companies I have done reviews for, man, has some great Delta 8. Um, but I'm starting to fall in love with more with the THCA. Um, CBG, I do enjoy. Um, THCO. Um, some some HHC bud, you know what I'm saying? It's it's kind of growing on me. Um, I'm not too big on the HHC yet, but like I said, they're growing on me. But we go, what we're gonna do is, man, I'm gonna roll up a joint, man. I'm gonna put a little bit of the Afghan Kush together with the um, Purple Gorilla, man. We're gonna smoke them both together, man, and get a good old smoke session. And all right, let's go.
Well, up, you guys? As you guys see, man, I got the joint all rolled up, man. Got the nice blazing Susan, you heard, man. Yes, sir. Taste is phenomenal. I'm going to take this outside, man, so stay tuned to me, y'all. Yo, what's poppin', gang? My side, man, as you guys see, man, I got the jig rolled up, man. About to go and blaze, man. Careful to him, man. Y'all always coming through, man. Huge shout out to y'all, man. Bro, it's just the beginning, dog. I'm telling y'all, man. I promise y'all, bro. When he comes to that gas, I promise you, cool. He's gonna let you know which company. I'm gonna put you on the ass. And Capra Hemp is one of them, you hear me? Yes, sir. Cheers, let's get it. I be enjoying my little sessions, man, as you guys see, man. Look at that burning smooth, perfect. Yes, uh, it's gas. I would say, like, smoking capital hemp is like, for a lot of people, it's gonna be the closest to, that's in illegal states, that's closest to getting some good bud, you know, like from your plug and shit. It may not be like the highest percentage in THC, but like I said, it's still testing it. 10% of Delta 9 THC, man. It's still, yeah, it's still hitting for something, bro. It's still powerful, dog. As you guys see, man, look at that, man. Rounding perfectly and smooth, man. Yeah, Let's take it back and get through. But it's an awesome smoke, man. It tastes great. Like, I would honestly, I would honestly have been smoking this like regular. You know what I'm saying? I've been smoking Capra and Hemp and uh, like, like it's regular, like, like it's everyday bud. That's what I be doing, man. I be smoking like it's regular shit. It always come fresh. I ain't ever got to worry about it, you know. You know, not being old, like it being old or not being fresh, um, not being cured properly or tasting just like too earthy, you know what I'm saying? Like you guys know there's some bud out there, like you guys have Delta 8 bud from like a smoke shop um, that hasn't been too fresh or that's been sitting down for quite a bit of time. Man, that should be tasting like, ugh, like that shit tastes gross. Like right? I've had bud where if it tastes like too earthy or tastes like just too like grassy or whatever, not just, it's not, I, I like some type of flavor. I like flavor, like, I, I'm, I'm big on the flavors wise. Um, I like gas, I do love gas here. Like I said, I love my OGs and things like that, man. Um, Capital Hemp always have some good bread, man. Like, I just like the fact that, you know, they got so much flavor today, they, but it's not added. It's like, it's not like you don't, you taste something, like, you taste shit in it. Like, you taste like they added a whole bunch of chemicals or anything like that. I, yeah, I don't taste that. I don't taste that at all. I don't get that effect. I don't get that feeling. I don't get headaches. Um, I don't be having a sore throat. Uh, I'm not coughing, you know. And shit like that. I, I don't. I don't care for all that coughing and shit like that. I, like I, I enjoy the high behind it. I want to be able to be high. And that's, the, that's one thing I noticed with this right here. I know it's the high man. It gets you where you want to be. It gets you exactly where your body needs to be. Yeah, just like that. 
Like, uh, yeah, you know, I'm just relaxed. I'm just chilling. I'm just enjoying the outdoors, man. The breeze is really feeling well right now. Got, like I said, they got the birds chirping. You know, that's pretty much a sense of relaxation to me. Um, a lot of people do enjoy outdoors. Like, some people like to sit by the beach at night, you know, hear the waves and hear the water. I don't mind that. Hey, I ain't gonna lie to you. I used to, when that, the clock that, uh, that made the different sounds and shit, my grandmother used to have one of them things. Every night, every night, I'll either, my favorite was, was the rainforest one. The other one was, well, I'm so high right now. I'm getting so high. Ooh. Y'all ain't close heading like me. Get out of here. Stop it. I know you talking, you listen, man, cool, it wasn't no good old ghost in here. There wasn't no good old ghost in here. And you do it, nigga. And send it to me, nigga, let me know. Send it to me, let me know. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, man, I just find smoking fun now, man. Um, when I first started, it was pretty much like, it wasn't, like they say, like, oh, it's to be cool or anything. I wasn't looking at it to be cool. I was just looking at it as something like, let me see the effects on what it does. Cause I see a lot of people say it's good for like people who deal with, you know, ADHD and stuff like that. And I was dying with ADHD when I was young. You know what I'm saying? I was on medication and all that shit there, man. That fuck with your body, dog. It really does fuck with your body, man. It fucks with your mind, it fucks with your body. Um, everything, you know what I'm saying? <sighs> your mind for sure. I'm gonna tell you that. It fucks with your mind for sure. And to be honest with you, since I've been smoking, I found that we pretty much helps me with slowing down with things with my ADHD as far as like talking, um, being able to focus a little bit more because sometimes I will start a task and then I'll stop and I'll jump to a different task, you know what I'm saying? I will finish what I started and that's I was that's a habit that I was having before but I had to grow out of that and I pretty much had to like work on it and that's something I pretty much did I try to just better myself you know what I'm saying and weed has helped me get to that stage and how is it how has it helped me is pretty, pretty much just keeping me calm keeping me relaxed and making me not feel like like I have to hurry up and rush and get something done like that was my problem like I be feeling like I have to hurry up and rush and get something done and I'll start something, then I'll be like, oh shit, I gotta do that too. And I heard from jump to that, you know what I'm saying? I'll start getting to that. And it, it, it just fucks with my mind because I'm like, oh shit, but I forgot I was doing that. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, oh. But as you guys see, man, I be just speaking, though. I just be speaking like, off the wall shit. Off the wall shit, y'all. But this is supposed to just be a regular little video, man, but I made it into a smoke session, man. I just hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. You know, reviewing Capital Hemp, man. New strains, bro, that just came, bro. Make sure to use the discount. You know, code in the description down below, man, to save some, you know, some coins. We all love to save them coins, you feel me? But other than that, man, Make sure y'all do me one favor before y'all log up in this video. Man. Make sure y'all like, y'all comment, y'all subscribe. Hit that notification bell, man, to get notified every time you boy drop them bangers. You hear me? We almost to 1500. So let's hurry up and run that up, man. Let's do that, man. Yeah, share, you know, tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend. You heard me? Pass it on. Keep on moving, man. Let's keep doing this shit. Let's keep on growing. Let's keep going. You hear me? You know, like I said, we're going to rock hard in this bitch. You feel me? Rock hard. Don't be boy about to clock out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Peace.